Imagine making $130,000 from just a 50 cent bet. This is what this guy did using what is known as parlay or multi betting. So what is parlay betting and how can you make money from it too? A parlay bet, otherwise known as a multi or accumulator bet in other countries, is a type of sports bet where you combine two or more individual bets into a single bet. Here's an example of a parlay bet. Imagine you want to bet on three basketball games. The first game has decimal odds of 2.0 for the first team to win. The second game has 1.75 odds for the team B to win. And the third game has 1.8 odds for team C to win. You can choose to bet on each game individually, or you can choose to place a parlay bet that combines all three games into one. And each of these is known as a leg. If you chose to place a $10 parlay bet on all three games, the overall odds of your parlay bet will be calculated by multiplying the odds of each individual game 2.0 times 1.75 times 1.8 which is 6.3. If all three teams win you would receive a higher payout of $63 which is 6.3 times 10 than if you had placed separate bets on each individual game. Parlay bets are popular because they offer a chance of a higher payout for a relatively small initial stake. In this case the individual placed a six leg parlay of the first basket scorer across six basketball games, which made the odds plus 26 million or over 260,000 in decimal odds, giving him the payout of $130,000 for a 50 cent bet. So would I recommend to you the parlay strategy of trying the same thing by combining six first scorers and hopefully winning big? Absolutely. Not. This is because while parlays give you higher odds and higher payouts if you do win, the chances of you winning are decreased by much more. This is because if just one of your legs, such as one of the teams to win or one of your first basket scorers, loses or is predicted incorrectly, the entire parlay bet is lost, no matter how many other legs you win, even if you won all the other ones. Basically, if the odds given to you in the parlay are worse than the fair odds, then the parlay odds are compounded in a way that that is even worse. If the fair odds for each leg of a hypothetical parlay was 2 and the sports book was offering 1.8, then the odds for a 10 leg parlay would be 1.8 to the power of 10 or 357. This is not even close to the fair odds of 2 to the power of 10 or 1024. And as such, you're getting ripped off by much more. And that's why sports books love the idiots who punt on parlays and encourage this practice as it makes them more money overall. For each lucky guy who wins big and goes on to boast about it, there's millions more who will never win a single parlay like this in their life. And of course, you're not going to be seeing about this because they're not going to be posting or showing off their losses on social media. However, there is a strategy that you can use to take advantage of parlays and make money, and I'm going to prove it to you using mathematics. The basic principle is combining legs into a parlay where each leg is positive EV. That means the odds given to you are higher than the fair odds. If you're not familiar with what positive EV is, then go watch my video on that first and then come back to this one. Let's take a look at a hypothetical scenario. There are three separate flips of a fair coin we'll bet on. Let's say the bookmaker is offering odds of 3 for heads and 1.5 for tails for each flip. Obviously in each case, the bet on heads is positive EV and the bet on tails would be negative EV. If we were to bet $100 on just the first coin toss, our expected value would be the probability it lands on heads multiplied by the payoff, otherwise known as the profit or loss if it lands on heads, plus the probability it lands on tails multiplied by the profit or loss if it lands on tails. This would be 50% multiplied by a positive $200 value plus a 50% multiplied by a negative $100 value, which is $50 in net expected value for this bet. If we were to bet $100 on a parlay where we say for each of these coin tosses, it will land on heads. So we're combining three legs and each leg is the first coin flip will be heads, the second coin flip will be heads, and the third coin flip will be heads. Then our odds to given to us will be 3 times 3 times 3, which is 27. The chances of each separate coin flip being heads is the product of the individual probabilities, which is 50% times 50% times 50% or 12.5% in total. Therefore, we have a fair probability 
of 12.5% of winning our parlay bet. And in all other cases, we don't win our bet. So we have an 87.5% chance of losing our parlay bet, which is when we would lose one or more of these legs, which would result in the whole parlay being lost. This means we can calculate our expected value. And that is 12.5% multiplied by a profit of $2,600 plus 87.5% chance multiplied by the $100 we lose if it doesn't win, which is $237.50 in expected value, much higher than the $50 expected value if we just placed a single bet on heads. This is because of the compounding effect of parlays when you multiply odds together. However, you will notice that our chance of winning has been reduced from 50% to 12.5%, making it riskier, but it does even out in the long term as long as you're getting positive EV bets. So it's very critical that you make sure for each individual leg, you're getting odds that are higher than the fair odds of what they should be, which is basically known as positive EV. Otherwise, this strategy won't work and you're going to be losing even more money than you would have if you just placed single bets. Let's take a look at how we can find a real life example. You can either find positive EV bets manually, which might take a bit longer, or you can use a sports betting odds comparison site like today's sponsor Odds Jam, which scans the odds across all the different sports books that you filter for and finds and lists out the best positive EV opportunities. For a parlay bet, we need to make sure that the positive EV bets are all on the same sports book. In this case, we'll use Odds Jam to filter for Bet365 sportsbook, as from a quick glance, it seems to have the most positive EV opportunities. We can do a three leg parlay, choosing the three bets with the highest positive expected value. In this case, the total goals across three different hockey games. Odds Jam uses a formula applied to a sharp sportsbook's odds pinnacle to determine the fair or no VIG odds. While this isn't as accurate as an exchange, we can still use them with some confidence as long as the width is relatively low, as this number represents how confident Pinnacle is in their rods. If we use this as the fair odds, then we can work out the fair probability that we'd win this bet, which is one of the product of the fair rods, which is one divided by 2.7 multiplied by 2.61 multiplied by 2.72, which gives us a 5.22% probability of winning. Then we can calculate the EV of a $100 three leg parlay if we combine all these legs. This is the probability we win all three legs multiplied by the profit if we win all three, minus the probability it doesn't win multiplied by the loss. This is 5.22% multiplied by a profit of $2,054.60 plus one minus 5.22% multiplied by a negative $100 loss, which is 5.22% times 2,054.6 plus 94.78% times negative 100, which gives us $12.41, which is a 12.41% expected value. This means although our chance of winning is smaller, our EV for the parlay bet at 12.41% is much greater than the EV we would have gotten if we just placed a single bet, which was 5.43% of expected value. OddsGem has the latest odds data of many bookmakers across the United States, Canada, Europe, and Australia, which means we can easily find legs for the parlay that are all positive EV. And as an added bonus, you can get 25% off your first month by one, using the link in the description down below, and two, using the code SHANE25 at checkout. Some other things of note is that this is the most basic form of parlay betting, where there's no correlation and all the things are independent from one another. There are also things such as same game parlays where you combine different events to happen in the game. For example, Phoenix Suns to win and Devin Booker to score 20 plus points. And here, where because of things like correlation and anti-correlation, it's a lot harder to calculate what the fair odds should be and therefore mathematically, what is a good strategy. So that's a quick run through of parlay betting give this video a big like down below and subscribe for other money making and sports betting tips and i'll see you guys in the next video